Hey YouTube, Bird Billy here. Oh, there she is. That's my new camp stove. It's a wood burning camp stove. It snaps together. It stores flat. Only comes in weighing about seven ounces. So this is a really lightweight camp stove. I'm gonna try it out here in the woods. Make a cup of coffee. Maybe something to eat. So this is working really good so far. You gotta keep feeding the sticks into it, but it's a low profile. I'm doing some, how should we put this, stealth coffee making, so I don't want to really be noticed. And that's definitely a low profile, not a lot of smoke, burns quick and clean. And uh, the only thing I'm worried about with this is my percolator. I just picked this up and the top, the, the top cap isn't glass. It's like a plastic or some material like that and I'm afraid that's going to melt so I'm going to see if they make a glass top for these. So my brother uses a percolator when he goes camping. He's got like a big seven or nine cup one. This is a little three cup one. I wanted that for me when I go out and do solo hikes. I wanted to try this out because he's informed me that once you've had coffee that's been percolated you don't like it any other way. So. I'm gonna see if he's right. Everybody likes their coffee how they like it. We're looking for the coffee to start bubbling up in that little plastic cap, which will hopefully one day be glass. All right, it just started percolating. So we're gonna let it percolate, I think they said for three minutes, and then I'll take it off the heat. Well, it's been about three and a half, four minutes. Went a little longer because the fire died down a little bit. And I like my coffee strong. Oh, that is hot. I'm not gonna be drinking this right away. Oh, but that looks good. The leaf just fell in there. Oh, that's protein. Things going like a blowtorch right now. I have to tell you, I'm very impressed with this stove so far. It's my first one, so I don't have much to gauge it by. But it did what it's supposed to do, and it did it well. All right, so we'll get the first taste of coffee here. It's hot. I'm let it sit a little longer. So I've got it going. Why not make something neat? I brought with me some creamy pasta and vegetable rotini. This is from the Wise Company at Wise Foods. I am not endorsing them. They've never given me a thing. Uh, I want to make that clear. I did a review, a partial review, just kind of talking about a pack that my brother had actually given me as a gift a couple years back. I never even opened it up, more than just a look at it. Never used it. And uh, upset a couple people because the company's got a bad reputation from what I understand. They've got lawsuits against them. That said, I did taste some of their food and it wasn't half bad. So I'm gonna use up what I got. You know, I'll let you know how it tastes. Again, I'm not endorsing them. They haven't paid me a penny. I don't know them. They don't know me. This is just a guy in the woods having a cup of coffee and decided to make a little something to eat. So I want to show you the little feed door on the side of this stove for feeding the twigs in. I like this feature. When I was looking, I saw some stoves that you had to feed them from the top. At least one I saw that was that way, and that was kind of a turnoff. I may actually pick that stove up just to review it so you guys can see it, see what I'm talking about and see how it actually performs. To me, if you gotta feed twigs in from the top, then you have to move your food every time you gotta feed stuff in. So that might not be as good an option as this is. This has been working out surprisingly well. I'm, I'm very impressed with this stove right now.
All right, so I just had my first taste of the coffee, a good taste, it wasn't too hot. Wow, this is some good coffee. Uh, I brewed eight o'clock, just a bag of regular eight o'clock coffee, nothing special. Super impressed with the flavor and taste on this. It's nice, very nice. The percolator kept the grounds out, so I don't have any in here. I really haven't seen any. And it's just some tasty coffee. I, I could not ask for a better cup. And this is a really nice setting. I'm, like I said, I'm doing a little stealth coffee drinking. But when I came in here, I'm in woods that are along some power lines. So you've got that tall grass in there. And there's a bunch of white-tailed deer running down there. And when they saw me, they took off. Super cool. I'm stoked. Uh, this is a really, really nice cup of coffee. This equipment's working out very well for me. Uh, I'll get the name of the stove up and the coffee pot as well. Nobody's endorsing me on this. This is just stuff I'm trying out, uh, getting ready for me to do some hikes and taking care of myself when I'm out doing my hikes and out in the woods. I wish you could smell and taste this right now. All right, time for a taste. Sorry if I'm slurping, it's hot. It's good. <sighs> oh yeah. That's the stuff.